Today it's cold out, but we're gonna take a ride, and I've already found somebody in the first five friggin' minutes. What's going on, bud? Some guy sitting down here at the fairgrounds, I have no idea who it is, just coming over here and cocking over the situation. So I had to come over here and see what it was in case they're trying to smile. Bring it right. How you doing, Jamie? That's Jamie, everybody. Hey, talk about him quite often. There he is. Let's see what we can get into with Life with Bills' YouTube channel. Well, we're gonna take a little ride, see what we can't find. I'm off this week, which is good because I'm having a friggin' sciatic nerve issue down my leg this week. So I gotta get some ibuprofen maybe while I'm out and slap that back, but we'll have to see. Other than that, I might work on some RCs tonight. I wanna get the crawler back together a little better because it's kind of rough, so we might do that together tonight or this week for sure. There's some ice breaking going on that I wanna check out. Leave your comments down below if you wanna see stuff like that because that's always cool to see. I gotta get some train videos for the other channel, maybe. I'm really interested in some ice breaking. We're gonna take a ride up here into Petrolia and get myself some ibuprofen, get that slap back, get this leg feeling better. Getting old sucks, don't let anybody tell you any different. And then uh, maybe head out and do something. Today's Sunday, I apologize I didn't have any videos yesterday, which was Saturday. Mom was working all day, and like I said, I, I didn't want to do anything with my leg, so I was kind of cocked over yesterday. Leave a comment down below if you have sciatic pain down your leg, because I feel you, Jim. One to two weeks it normally lasts, then it eases up. So it should be all right soon enough. Like I said, I'm just glad I'm on holidays this week, right, right now. Don't forget to subscribe, like, get the notification if you like this uh, going out and finding something to see kind of video, which will be on the next one or the next one or the next one. That's what I do, but it's colder than dicks out. Nine Fahrenheit out right now. Freeze my unit off out here. I still haven't figured out how the hell to get this stupid thing to switch over to Celsius either. I wonder if I have to hold this. Let's see. Oh, oh there it is. Okay, we got her, Jim. Perfect. There we go. So it's minus 13 Celsius out for you Canadians, and it's minus, or it's 9 Fahrenheit for you Americans. She's a cool day. I don't know how well the drone's gonna fly in this cold of weather, but we're gonna friggin' find out. I better record to the uh, phone or the iPad just in case I lose it. That way I don't lose the footage. Jamie mentioned that this morning. Thanks, Jamie. I'm gonna have to turn that on, Jim. See how she works. Captain. But I'm glad you all are here. If you're a new subscriber, welcome to the channel. Thanks for coming over. Appreciate it. Don't forget to tell your family members and friends about me and get them hooked on her. I know some things I do is annoying, but some things I do are fun. I'm doing an LS build right now, as everybody knows that are on the channel. Kind of waiting. I'm gonna pick up some injectors for it next week. Just getting a couple of uh, couple of paychecks behind me. I gotta make up the difference from that intake. Thousand dollar intake there, Captain. So if I'm not gonna charge anything, I gotta stop, wait until I collect some more and get some more, right? That's how I'm doing it. Put myself a little, little bit of money away every paycheck. And when I get enough money to buy the next part, I buy it. So that's why my LS bill is gonna take a little longer. But I am planning on pulling the van apart this summer, so don't worry. The van's gonna come apart and the engine should be set in the hole, Ski. And we'll see how far it gets from there. I think I have just about everything I need to do. I'm still gonna do the transmission, but I'll tell you right now, when it's cold out and your garage ain't that big, it puts a little dampener on what it does. If I had a garage that was warmed up all the time and I could just walk out and it's warm, then I'd do it. Cold in there. I don't have a heater in my garage yet. I just have micro furnaces and stuff. And right now it's so cold that it hardly heats it up. It's minus 12 Celsius now. Went up a degree. So that's an update on that. If you have any other questions for me, leave them down below. And maybe I should do a live, live questionnaire someday here. I got a call from somebody last night and you know who you are. Don't call me, dude. I'm not answering your phone. I'm not gonna go on a live chat with you. So don't bother calling me. I'm done with that, Jim. You do your thing, I'll do my thing. Have a good life and carry on. But other than that, I have nothing to say, brother. So do what you wanna do, but leave me out of it. So there you go. If you know who you are, that's a, just a little message for you. Leave me the f alone, Captain. Thanks anyway. Hopefully the old um, Shoppers Drug Mart's open up here. The old icebreaker Samuel is out doing some ice breaking, so let's go down there and we'll take a ride and we'll see if we can't catch it. Because I've got nothing else to do today and it's cold out, so I might as well do something. I did mount my wireless mic to the top of my drone with the wire hanging down to see if I get any audio from the drone. Still, the blades were still there. You could hear things though, but the problem I had was the reception. I have a cheap wireless mic. As soon as I get too far away, it just loses signal, so. <laughs> If I had a better one, I'd try it again. But I don't, I just have a cheap one, so. That video didn't air because it just didn't turn out too good. But I'm gonna slip up here, put on some tunes, do a cruise, have a coffee, and we'll see when we get there. Friggin' right. I'm in 
Sombra right now. And in Sombra, there used to be a ferry that ran Port Huron, Michigan, or St. Marysville, or whatever it was, over to Sombra. So I want to do a fly here because the river is packed. It's not even moving, Jim. And if it is moving, it's barely moving. So let's just stop talking here and get the drone up in the air and we'll take a look at it. What do you think of that? I think it's a wonderful idea. These are the kind of things I love to do and I hope you enjoy them too. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell if you agree. Well, why wouldn't you? But I am looking for oh, my little doodad. Thing of Bob or whatnot. Where the hell I put that to hold my iPad? Because I like flying with my iPad because I can see more. Let me look in the back. There it is. Open the door and it fell out. There you go. Yup. Oh God, leaking all over the place. Ow. Now up along the river here, there should be an icebreaker somewhere. I don't know if he went back into shore. I seen him earlier, but he's gone now. So I've never flew this drone in minus 12 degree weather. So we're gonna have to see how it does. And we're gonna keep her close until we find out how it does. <laughs> I'm not gonna lose a $1,500, $1,600 drone because of some ice. Well, maybe. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. I gotta make sure I format this thing before we take her off the ground. And I should put my sun lens on. Frank. See here, I thought I was ready. <laughs> Takes time to do these videos for you guys. Remember that. Are you living in the expense yet? That's pretty dark, that one. I think that's it. I gotta get some different lens filters for this. This one's not as dark as the other one. Okay, so this one's not as dark. So we're gonna go with this guy. I don't want something too dark. But when the sun's out, make sure you change your filter and your dronage. Oh, it didn't like that too much. Might be a good idea to change your filter before the drone's on because the gimbal's saying, hey, what the hell's going on? And you'll end up skipping a gear or two. All right, there we go. All right, let's get her up on the roof here. And we'll get her, see if we can take off in the freezing cold weather. Well, so first thing I want to do is format the card, get rid of all the old footage, save room for some good footage. So I'll probably call this one Ice Jam. We'll go 1080p at 60 frames per second, because my computer ain't 4K anyway, so. Well, she's flying, Jim. We'll take off over here. We're already recording, too, so that's perfect. What are you beeping at? Stop your beeping. So let's get up here, and I'll show you a varial view here of how much ice is on the river. It's friggin' crazy. Like, this is less than a week, and there's this much ice on the river. Look at that, Captain. Looks like a field, it does. Field of dreams. We'll go back this way towards the Blue Water Bridges. Sarnia. Sarnia's way down there, Captain. Dice is making the water level really high. So a lot of these docks and stuff just cocked right over there. Look at this guy. What do you want, bud? Hey. You keep going, Chachi. Bring it right, you best be. Keep going. He's just looking at the ice jam like I am. But I got a better view than he does. So right there is the old ferry. And I'm pretty sure that now this is privately owned. And they got the dredgers in here and they're going to start fixing the Dockerooski. Now I have been told that birds like to do drone hits they do. We'll have to see. So there you go. Check that out. All right, that's pretty awesome. So there's some birds. So we're going to stay away from them leave them alone. But there's the old ferry. And that's an island. And that used to be a road right there, but it looks like the ice is definitely high. Big time. Look at that. No oh, way. What's really going on? Just encroaching in this guy's situation. Hope you don't mind, bud. That's pretty awesome. Man, that's a lot of ice, eh? There's America. Just want to kind of come out here and show you this. And we'll take a ride down river further and check out some more. The drone seems to be okay in this cold weather, so that's a good thing. Where am I? I'm way down here, Jim. Have an eye, Captain. How you doing, Canadian flag? How you doing, bud? Hey, eh? right here. So I don't think there's any wires on this side of the road. No, they're on the other side, so we should be good to come right on in. Oh, yeah, yeah. You relax, would you? Careful. Ooh, she's windy. She's windy, windy. She's windy, windy. Oh, that's a good way to land it. I can hit it against the side of the truck. Why wouldn't I? You okay, bud? <laughs> well, that's a first. <laughs> Let's not do that too often, eh? Oh, God. How you doing? <laughs> yeah, you're all right, bud. You're okay. 
Well, I'm just sitting here waiting. There's an icebreaker coming down, so we're gonna catch this and you'll see it on the next video. This is what I'm up to today. Hopefully you're up to the same thing. Leave any comments down below and let me know. Why wouldn't you? But I'll do a little time lapse on the way home from where I was, so you can check it out at the end of the video. Hope you guys like it. Hope you stick around. Hope you subscribe. Why wouldn't you? But until next time, love y'all, and you know what to do for now.